everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we'll be going on a tour of the Columbus Library. So this is the outside of the library. That is actually a famous structure um, that was designed by an architect, an architect that used to live here in Columbus. And that's the main entrance to um, the Columbus Library. So let's go in. So when you first enter into the library, you'll see like a display of books. And then past that is like the adult section where all the adult books are. And on each shelf, there's like um, a label that describes the type of books that you're going to find on that shelf. So take a look around. That is like the main place to check out your books. And this is like the digital part of the library. Like, this is where you can get, like, all your CDs and, like, your, all your DVDs um, for movies and stuff like that. Um, you can find a lot of these computers, these computers around the Columbus Library. They help you find books that are available in the library and books that are available online. And this, uh, these, these, these books are um, like nonprofit resources and oversized nonfiction. And then these are actually exam books, so you can use these books f for preparation um, for certain examinations. So this is the teen section. Um, really, it's the same thing as the adults. Um, there are like descriptions on the shelves about what type of books there are. And there's like a checkout area towards the middle. That is like a story tell area for the kids. And this is the entrance to the kids section in the library. While we were at the library, we got to ask uh, one of the librarians a couple questions. I love seeing people come in and I love seeing the happy looks on their faces when we find the book that they've been waiting to read. Um, and uh, like, you know how each year the library adds something like something new like a read summer reading program like for example uh -huh. so what's one of your favorite things that they've added to the library hmm that's a really really good question because there is always something new i think my favorite thing new that we've done at the library is in our picture book section when we reorganized it so everything was organized by topic instead of alphabetically and it made it a lot easier for little kids to find the books they wanted and um, that's been really cool, seeing them able to find their own books. Thank you. Yeah. This is the fiction area of the kids section. So there are like a lot of diary of wimpy kids, Geronimo Stilton, spy school, and graphic novels um, in this section. This is the nonfiction section. So it has a lot of autobiographies, biographies, books about animals and books in all different languages. So while we were at the library, um, I saw my former music teacher, Miss Ho Settler, and I got to ask her a couple questions about the library. What's your favorite section of the library and like why you keep coming back to the library all the time? And yeah. Sure. So, 
Um, so I'm a teacher, so I love being able to use the library. Um, like this week, I'm teaching a day camp about uh, germs and, and dinosaurs. And so just being able to find resources here to help other people. Personally, for me, I like to read a lot of fiction books. So that's where I go for my own reading. But um, there's just, you can always find something new every time you're here. Thank you so much. Sure thing. Really, thank you. So this is like the kids area, I guess. Um, so there are like super easy books here for kids in kindergarten, pre-K, and first grade. And in front of me is like a huge play area for the kids to just play and hang out with their friends. because since we're at the library, that's a whole point of a library to get books. So I'm just going to go around and see some of the new books that came in and just look around and see what books I like. enjoyed my tour of the Columbus Library. Remember to subscribe and leave a thumbs up. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!